This is a CBS News special, America Decides, Campaign 24, the Republican National Convention. Now reporting, Nora O'Donnell. I am here in program, yeah. Hello, guys. Good evening from Milwaukee. Tonight, Republicans begin presenting their case for giving Donald Trump a return to the White House in another four more years as president. Welcome to CBS News coverage of the Republican National Convention. If you can believe it, we're now 113 days away from the election, and this year's convention is different. It's unlike any other because it comes in the shadow of this weekend's attempted assassination of the former president during a campaign rally in Pennsylvania. Trump selected. Ohio junior senator J.D. Vance as his running mate. Now, J.D. Vance uh, was elected to the Senate in 2022. He was also endorsed by the former president during his campaign. And this long-awaited VP announcement came just before Trump's son, Eric, pledged, officially pledged Florida's delegates in a roll call to push Mr. Trump over the threshold and secure the Republican presidential nomination for the third time. That's noteworthy because the last three conventions have all nominated Donald Trump, a reminder of just what a hold he has on the Republican Party. I want to introduce my CBS News colleagues here with me, Chief Election Campaign Correspondent Robert Costa, Political Correspondent Caitlin Hewitt, Burns and Chief Washington Correspondent Major Garrett. Great to have all of you here as we watch this Republican convention. Major, just to start with you, we were talking about